excellencies, partners, friends. Substandard and falsified medicines represent a global problem, affecting all countries of all income levels at every stage of development. But the community's hardest hit are those with weaker health systems, precisely those places where people need safe and effective medicine. According to WHO, one in 10 medical products in developing countries is substandard or falsified. In some African countries, the proportion can reach 20 to 30 percent. This includes vital, life-saving medicines like antimalarials and antibiotics. This comes at a great cost to health systems and, most importantly, to children's lives. One study found that up to 169,000 children may be dying each year from pneumonia due to substandard or falsified medicines. Another estimates that over 100,000 deaths from malaria could be caused by these medicines. We must not accept this. We call on governments, scientists, and pharmaceutical companies to join this fight by developing and deploying technologies that can detect falsified and counterfeit medicines. By calling on policymakers to strengthen regulatory systems for health products and develop tighter regulatory controls at every stage of the distribution channel, from manufacturer to communities. And by calling on governments to ratify the Medicrime Convention to make falsification a criminal offense. Over the years, UNICEF has built a lot of experience and expertise around this issue. We apply the strictest standards for the medicines we purchase to support children's health, such as vaccines and antimalarials. We work with partners like WHO to strengthen supply chains, including using technology that can track products at every step of delivery. We support WHO's pre-qualification program that ensures the quality of vaccines and medicines for billions of children and their families. We work with other UN agencies and the Global Fund to promote locally produced medicines and other health technologies. And we're teaming up with local authorities to raise awareness about this critical issue. We want to be a part of the solution. All of us at UNICEF look forward to working with partners like you to put an end to this practice and ensure that every child in every community has access to medicines of the highest quality for their health, for their futures, and for the futures of their communities and countries.